What I'm passionate about doing with Meta is undoing the last 30 years of painful interaction with the computer. The screen is small, so you have to invent buttons and menus and all these abstract symbology that's hard for the brain to interact with. And opening an entire new era of interaction between man and machine that is fluid, that leverages our body, our senses, the way we're used to perceiving reality. And I think the, the pathway to that, the map to that, is by merging the neurosciences with the art of user experience. And this is a new discipline we call neurointerface designs. I was in academia for almost 20 years, studying the human visual brain. Uh, and the human visual behavior, how human process information, which turns out to be a highly important mission as you develop a product in augmented reality. Our brain can use uh, simplified information to recognize objects. So I'm here at Meta to use uh, research like my own um, to facilitate building a very simple and easy to use operating system. So for example, here what we have is a corner frame. And what we do is we get the user to manipulate this frame with their hands and we track the movement of this frame as we go. And what we essentially do is we take all this data, whether it's about the accuracy or how long it actually takes to complete a certain task, and dissect that to try and show that either A, something's a really good thing to include in our final product or else disprove why it may, may not be such a good idea. So we have this opportunity now to design a world of holographic interfaces that's 100 times more intuitive than any one of the traditional computers that we currently use. And that's what gets me excited.